multiple follicles start developing none of them mature and so all of them start filling with fluid and they become cystic so it is called as polycystic do you have a sedentary lifestyle lack of exercise do you eat out often and eat junk food if yes then these are the causes of pcos Hi, I am Dr. Aparna Ghosh, consultant gynecologist at Apollo Hospital, Chembur. Today, I will be talking about PCOS or PCOD. PCOS means Polycystic Ovarian Syndrome. It is also called as Polycystic Ovarian Disease. This disease can occur right from teenage girl to a middle-aged woman. What happens in PCOS is it is called as polycystic because there are multiple follicles developing in the ovary which are fluid filled and they become cystic so it is called as polycystic what happens in a normal menstrual cycle a single follicle develops and then it ruptures ovulation occurs and after 14 days a girl gets her period but in a polycystic case what happens is multiple follicles start developing none of them mature and so all of them start filling with fluid and they become cystic so it is called as polycystic so what happens is the girl doesn't get her period because there is no ovulation and the periods get delayed so the symptoms of pcos are number 1 irregular periods the second symptom is acne the third symptom is excessive facial hair and the fourth symptom is obesity so what are the causes of pcos do you have a sedentary lifestyle lack of exercise do you eat out often and eat junk food if yes then these are the causes of pcos so diagnosis of pcos is made by three methods first is the physical examination of the patient in that we check for the weight of the patient the body mass index and then second whether she has acne and third whether she has hirsutism which is excessive facial hair then second is by blood test blood tests are hormonal assays which are done on the second or the third day of the period and third is a sonography a sonography is done to see the size of the ovary and the uh, follicular pattern of the ovary so nowadays girls are very much scared of pcos i get patients coming in with oh ma'am ma i have got pcos i have got pcos so there's nothing to be afraid of it's not a major disease it's just a lifestyle disease you just have to concentrate on your diet your weight reduction exercise and stop eating junk food that is the only treatment so the treatment of pcos depends on the age group of the patient so there are three age groups we'll be seeing first age group is a teenage girl who has come in with a irregular periods or a heavy periods so in this age group we can intervene medically only if the periods are heavy or she has not got periods for 4 to 5 months the major concentration will be on lifestyle modification and your choice of food the second age group is a married woman who is come in with the complaints of infertility she is not able to conceive with pcod so in this age group we will have to treat her medically and the third age group is a woman who is completed her family and she has got pcod now so in this age group we will be only concentrating on lifestyle modifications and diet if you have any queries or comments please comment in the comment box below thank you